I'm giving you an official and personal apology. I don't, I don't understand why. You clearly saw something important in the 6-2025 file, and I ordered you not to pursue it. It was a poor tactical decision, and I apologize. As I was, friend. For the decision, or- For all my misconceptions related to your video work. I should not have doubted your loyalty after your service in the field. I'm no longer pursuing a court-martial. I don't, I don't know what to say. Get a grip, soldier. You've got your wits. Use them. You salute, I salute back. We both fight -o. It was a good plan. I understand it was largely Barker's, but I'm still impressed. You don't know. I see. Awkward. Your plan involves my videos? Your videos, as I just learned, implicate a plot by Harry Fremont, Callie Albright, and Dane Valen to kill their predecessor and seize power. No! I mean, kind of. Not Dane. Trace and- Trace isn't nobody. You've got your fake friends here. You know what I see? Motive. Collusion. Fractionization. Method. Result. It's a simple story. Albright and Fremont wanted to take Maddie's command, so they planned to kill her while Fremont seduces Valen to accure, ensure his assistance. That is not what happened. Yes, it was. Didn't you see the photos? My barking brother will write up the report. We'll spread it, and the photos, and any video message that supports it. All around the Greenden ranks, and then Greenden will go up in flames. Your branch will have a lot to do within the next few days. You'll be earning your keep. Oh, no. Consider what you say next. I only apologize once. Until the end. We were saving this for a special occasion. Treasure it. Cost as much as a sack of flour. For Folgers, I might add. I forgot how bitter it is. We bought time. A few hours at least. We have an armed guard on the FRB convoy and the gasoline drained out of their car. You're all informed. To the best of my knowledge, we all know everything here, right? Mm -hmm. You should drink that before it gets cold. I have proof. What? Of the FRB's involvement. It's on the camera. There's two. I have videos from when Kimba first started working for them. And one, it's on another. I, I copied it onto another card and deleted it off this one. Harry, you have it. No, I don't. What do you mean? She gave me a card, everything she had recorded up until that point, and I put it in my lockbox, which I keep... I kept in the lab. Maybe it survived? Not with the video intact. We need to get the FRB out of here. How do we do that? I appreciate the irony of being the one to say this, but... Do we need proof? Yes, and we're not. Even if the FRB would destroy us, we need actual solid proof. Oh, you mean other than the burned people in our hospital? I'm going to visit Adrian and Charlie. Charlie was awake for a while. How did he seem? All right. He said that there was very little pain in his arm. Uh, that's bad. Um. Anna said that it means that there's a lot of deep damage to the nerves. Okay. 
And Ju Ying? She stayed asleep. Have you arrested Mr. Everett yet? We can't. Not without proof. You recorded everything. The cards are in the fire. In, in Harry's lockbox. Lockbox? Rachel, can you? It's under. Uh, I fell when Charlie blocked the beam. And I, it was under the table. citizen to give information. And when we were at our weakest, you appeared to lend a helping hand, but what you were really trying to do was install FRB leadership and reliance on your laughably limited supply. These are baseless accusations! Quiet, Patty. And when we presented a unified front, you tried to have me killed. <laughs> Which frankly probably would have just pissed him off. You have attempted assassination through a third party in Greendon for the second time. The first was against Maddie Vallon during the 2013 assembly. Well, if that's the case, you should be thanking me. Mr. Everett, Maddie may have been a bully and paranoid and an elitist, but you pushed her over the edge, and for that, I think I can spare some frankly hellish unbridled rage. I hardly spoke to Maddie Vallon. Green is just a bunch of teenagers playing in the woods. Thank goodness for that. Not many societies can outplay you. You got hooks into the brick keys, began a peaceful takeover of Mission State Park, which ended in its abandonment. But we were just a mob of teenagers in the woods. Your attempts at political murder are not appreciated, Mr. Edwards. You failed. You have no proof. Actually, we have some videos we want you to watch. We thought the three of you should hear the real story before we released Kimber. Mm. Hi. You okay? It's a lot to take in. You knew? I didn't know the details. I didn't know that the FRB was controlling Kimber. Uh, I feel funny. Well, I mean, Anna did drug you up pretty bad, uh, Charlie. Uh, You've only been coherent for the past 20 minutes or so. Before that, you just talked about your hair a lot. Oh, it, it is spectacular. It is. I agree. Mm. I like it. Story of my life, right? What? It... Your hair? <laughs> Harry wasn't even in the building. I thought the same. We both made that mistake. Mm. Why would Kimber just... Kimber, you asked me if there was anything that that the FRB could have been holding over Kimber. The way you had nowhere to go, but they don't have that anymore. Because you can stay here, right? It, I would like to. It's not safe, but it's, it's an alternative. You don't think I'll betray you? Just promise me you'll do it for a good reason. Good things happen to, to good people, right? No, that's... Bad things happen to good people. And good people can do bad things. We'll need to get our medication from the FRB before they're taken to the border. Okay. I, I, I can do that. You are I'm not moving, Charlie. Bullshit. I, I got... Uh. I'll go find her. Will you guys be okay for now? I'll keep an eye on him. Hey, um, could you bring Kimber back here after she's out of holding? Kimber! Kimber! 
We got them. Adrian saved the cards. He kept the evidence. Everett's been arrested. Kimber? <laughs>